Okay, so today I'm going to go ahead and set up the RFID tag lo locator within Tracer Plus, which is commonly referred to as the RFID Geiger counter. What this uh, feature allows you to do is simply uh, press a button on your mobile application within Tracer Plus and find that tag. And what happens is, as you pull the RFID trigger on the device, it will beep louder and louder and faster and faster as you get closer to the tag. So it's a very easy way to go ahead and find the, uh, an item that you're looking for within Tracer Plus, and it's a really cool feature to uh, just walk up and down in the aisle or offices or something like that and locate the item or asset that you're looking for. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and set that up within the application here today. So far, all I've done is I've added a form to my Tracer Plus desktop project, and I have one field here called Item to Locate. I, what, what I put this on the form to do today was so that the user can just key in the, the uh, tag that they'd like to find, and I'm going to put a button on here so that they can easily find that tag. Now, important thing to note here is I'm using the text field where the user types in what they want to look for, but you could also do something else, like add a drop down to your form so they can pick from a list of items, or you can even add a grid control to your form that would allow the user to search and filter that grid control down to the item they're looking for, and then they would go ahead and uh, press the same button that I'm going to configure today to go ahead and locate that item. So the first thing I need to do is just simply add a button to the form. I'm going to go ahead and put this right next to my tag to uh, item to locate field. I will put a uh, change the caption to be find. And the next thing all I need to do is set the button action to be the RFID tag locator action, which is in this list here. So we will go ahead and RFID tag locator. We'll select that. Um, now we need to configure uh, just one thing about this button. And it's really telling the button, when I click it, what tag am I looking for? Well, the, the item to locate field is number five here. You can see this is where the user is going to be keying that value in. So what I need to do is for my button in the tag ID, control ID field here, I just want to put that value of five. So what this means is anytime I click this button on my mobile application, grab the value that's in the field, and that's the value we're going to find now. And then the user is just simply going to press this button, pull the trigger on the RFID device, and they're going to go ahead and easily find that item based on the beeping strength of the, on the device. They'll hear that sound as they get closer and closer to the, the item that they're looking for. So the last thing I need to do here is just deploy this to my device. So I will just go ahead and go through the deployment process. Now let's uh, finish this up by going ahead and taking a look at how it works. 